Alright everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we're playing some Warwick in the top lane. We're running Lethal Tempo, Presence of Mind, Alacrity, Last Stand, Second Wind, and Revitalize. We're gonna go max attack speed Warwick. We're gonna hit 2.5 attack speed, build a bunch of on-hit items. And we'll be able to build more too. I'll be able to build tank items after that because we'll hit the attack speed cap pretty easy. Because we get a lot of free attack speed on Warwick, especially if the target is low HP. But I want to try and build a Hexplate, so after I ult I get even more attack speed. I think we'll do Blade of the Ruined King, Hexplate, Rage Blade, and we might have room for one more, like a Kraken Slayer or something. And then after that we can go Jack Shows, or we could do Terminus Jack Shows, that's always a great combo to get a ton of defense while also getting a lot of offense too. If you didn't know, play Warwick top, you could take Barrier, and you could bait people into some pretty free kills, because the lower... They get the faster you attack, but also, when you're low, you can do more damage with Last Stand, and then you could pop Barrier Q, instantly go back up to like half health from 10%. He Q's back in. He could die. Holy Bear, Jungle... Or do we just have vision of his red? Did he just do red? He might come top before he goes to his bot side. But I think I'll be able to get away. I'm gonna try and chunk Yone a little bit more. Also, I think if I have Hexblade and I ult somebody, I'll instantly be at full lethal tempo stacks, because the ult counts as four hits. I can auto Q afterwards, and then I'll be at six. But Blade of the Rune King first item on Warwick is just god tier. have like so much stuff going on in chat every single one of my games. <laughs> Curse would be a Yumi talking about panic attacks. He's got door and shield. I can fight him in this whole wave though. I have better sustain than him. I can just Q minions if I want to heal. Try and zone him off the cannon. It worked. I use my potion just to get my HP up in case. He's in, gonna be in a rough spot because it's gonna be in front of my turret. And every time he's gonna want farm, he's gonna have to trade me. But since I can get a push back into him, I should hit six first if I do this right. If I keep freezing, he'll hit six first. But if I get this to start pushing back, I will hit it. He's also getting denied a ton of farm. I think we got him. I think we can beat this guy too. Oh my god, I didn't even barrier or ult because I wanted to limit test and see. Just to show you how broken Warwick is once the target gets low and your lethal tempo's going. We could even bait Yone into a kill. Oh, look how much I've healed too. I still have ult and barrier. Oh, 
Oh my god, I timed it perfectly. And pop back with Z. Yep. There it goes. Oruk is a monster. Alright, well. Oh, he bought anti-heal too. Fortunately for me, I'm not doing a full healing build. I'm going on hit. I just want to finish Blade. I don't really need the boots that bad because I can use my alt to engage. I mean, this stacks up to... I feel like with Blade of the Rune King, Rage Blade, and Hex Blade, I might already be hitting max attack speed after ulting, but we'll see. I think just a Terminus after that into Jack shows and we're good. Did this guy just flash out of his own thing? Okay, I got pretty lucky there. My Q just straight up killed him because if it didn't kill him, I think he might have killed me. We can just chill here. I don't think Yone can fight me. I just out damage. I thought I saw him walking in the bush. Since he went anti heal, it's gonna delay his Blade of the Rune King a lot too. It's gonna take him a while to finish it. I feared him. Oh, she's dead. I'll do like a uh, auto queue. I think Vully Bear's pathing up here. I think we're base. I don't have enough man mana. Maybe I do. Oh, he's gonna keep my bush. Ah, oh, shoot. I'm fine. Enemy has been slain. Enemy has been slain. Far and 
Ow. Oh my gosh. Alright, I guess I'm recalling. Karma's gonna push me out. Blade boots. I mean, I don't think we need attack speed boots, but I might build them. I'll build them. We'll go uh, hex play next. It'll give me a bunch of HP. I wish Lethal Tempo still put you over the cap. Like, just take away the on-hit damage from it. And just give it the attack speed cap override. My minions. I follow the trail. Will I get a kill? Maybe. Mm, now with this guy around. But we just lost bot turret because Varus was up here for an hour. I think with Blade I can just tank the minions. Yeah, look at that. 1.87. Oh, that's not a low health target. 2.5 already. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I was like, barrier, barrier, wait, I don't have it up, and I hit both of them. They're both yellow, okay? Um, I either get two swords, or I get two ruby crystals, or one of each. We could do one of each. I probably just gave him a ton of money. Only 400. Yep, yeah, dragon. I think Barris is fine. We're out. It's hard for a unit to ult me because if I Q him, I go behind him. Then I could dodge his ult with that. gonna take this really quick. Why is that guy so fast? He's on the chickens. I have map hacks. Gotcha. Wait a second. Oh, there's a turret. Never mind. Goodbye, Karma. You kind of want to grab that blue. It's a bit of a mission. I think I got time to go get it. 30 seconds. I am slow, but... Ooh, if we go Zerkers, we can get the Zephyr or whatever. Yes. 
which really isn't going to do anything but give us a little bit of move speed. Because the extra attack speed will already be at the cap, I think. Now I've got unlimited Qs. Where's Hexplate? Need 250. I mean, I'm going to get two or three men if I push this far up. Oh, I should have queued it. My cannon. Come here. No free hits. I get to chomp you. Where? Darn, I marked him instead. I think they're full HP. Oh, they're full HP. Ow. Darn, I think Karma flashed away when she was 1 HP. I should have ulted her earlier. Oh, we got the Hex Plate. What do I get? 30% attack speed, 15% move speed after ulting. Okay, you could block. That actually would have killed Ari. Alright. I think Caitlyn's E was still on cooldown. He's reduced 1k of my healing. Vagar is scaling. He'll be pretty big. That's really going to be the only issue, though, is Vagar. I think if he wasn't there, I would have killed him. Killed Karma, at least. Work passive is weird. Like, to get that extra attack speed when they're 1 HP, you have to click again. Otherwise, it kicks in too late, and it doesn't give you the speed. You have to, like, keep spam-clicking the target. I don't know if I can do much with this guy under turret, because he'll just wait for a gank. Oh, it doesn't bring me through that. I figured if I held Q, it would bring me through his wall. And see what my attack speed went up to there, which is two items. I'm guessing it was over two. Terminus next. I think I'm on vision. I think I just leave him alone and go roam around. He's gonna be too hard to kill under turret with anti heal. And I gotta clear another wave. I knew that was coming out. That's what I was waiting for the whole time. Okay. If we can bait him to go back in like that, we can kill him. <laughs> he messed up multiple times there. He E'd poorly, and then he ulted. It's all it was fine. I just sidestepped it.
I mean, Rage Blade probably works with this, so we'll grab it. And then, after ulting, I'll stack up Rage Blade, Lethal Tempo, and I'll have the Hexblade attack speed. I'll just be max attack speed after ulting. I think there's three of them. Might be walking into... Ow. I can't go in this. I think I'll die. The thing is, I only have single target damage. I can't fight like their whole team at once. I'll lose. Aelin does a lot of damage. The Vagar is still mid, so that's a free kill. Oh, I lived. Go clear these minions, get Rage Blade. Once a Vega gets Death Cap, he can one shot anybody on our team. He built anti heal too, though. We got the Rage Blade. Yeah, 2.5. There we go. Ow, 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 ow. Oh my god. Okay, I didn't know if that was gonna hit me or not. Dude, she actually almost hundred to zeroed me there, and I didn't even have a chance to do anything. I think she hit everything on me. So after alting and queuing, I get them down to half health, which gives me the uh, gives me the extra attack speed, and that puts me at two point five. I wonder if he knows. I don't care, I'm going for him. You gotta come back here. <laughs> no way, are you kidding me? That is insane. He got two shields at one HP which kept him alive. That's so unlucky for me. Uh, we'll just go Terminus. I'll get this. That actually sucks, man. He literally had like 20 seconds standing over here with his E. I think he extended it even longer by ulting. I don't know about this. He needs vision in that bush. Dude, every single person on their team's built an anti-heal. What is this? They actually have four anti-heals. We we don't even have that much healing on the team. I'm coming. Alright, he died. Oh, what the hell? 
I should have just ulted Volibear earlier in the fight. Because I knew they were all going to catch up. Oh, so close. The issue is... Caitlyn has too much peel. But, use my passive well there. I saw she was recalling the bush and nobody helped her. If we have a DC, we're going to lose. At least he came back right away. Here, Caitlyn can kill me pretty easy. So can Vagar. Luckily, he's not getting a death cap. Might as well, the first person I see, Ari can just charm him. But it's near impossible to kill Vega or Kate if I don't have ult or flash up. Be careful. I'll have my terminus off this wave, I think. So maybe last item Jack shows we might be able to build another attack speed item. I don't think so though, but we'll go Kraken Slayer, use that move speed to catch people. I think they just caught Kate. Nice. Um I can just pop W and scare him away. Oh, Vagar's here. Oh. I got the Hexblade move speed to disengage. Let me go buy this. I think I'll be... Definitely a max attack speed after ulting. They're looking for picks. They're going to keep sending like three, four people for one person. I think we can we can turn this bot. Lost Varus. Kate's not here. Or they both flash. Yeah, that's max, max attack speed after ulting. We can just get some hits on this turret. Nah. Let's try to Baron. They're not really going to leave base. They're going to turtle. Oh my gosh. Okay, they're breaking the concrete downstairs. Fortunately, we're almost done with this game, so I finished in time.
No, I got headshot. Dude, the Yone just... <laughs> the Yone came out of nowhere and blocked the ult on the cape. That's so funny. We won the fight, though. He saved her. Alright, guys. You aced him. Either do dragon, inhib, or... End the game. Youch, look at that damage. I don't know if selling the blade for chain best is worth. But I'll do it. I only need 900 for this. Gotta be careful, their whole team's around here. I just wanna get vision of Baron. Just wanna see if they're doing it. I think I just need to try to ult Kate. Cause if she's auto, she kills me in like three, four auto attacks. I mean, oh, we caught Kate. Get her. Oh, nice. All right, got her. I think we're fine. Good all. This guy's dead. Max attack speed. I think we can inhib into. Baron, we might be on the end. We don't have any minions though, so we have to tank. Oh, we got grubs. Grubs are OP. If we didn't have grubs there, we wouldn't be able to get the turret. We should go to Baron. Alright, I guess not. I'll go get Jack Shows. Build just need a tenacity potion. A fifty one second ult with only five haste. What am I getting five haste from? Dragon. I feel like Jarvan beats Kate if he just ults her, but she'd probably have flash barrier or something. I don't need the cannon. Wait, why are you 1 HP? Somebody's here. Hang on, somebody wants you. Got her. No way this happens again. I'm gonna get Kate ulted, so I need to keep... Oh, nice. Ari's been doing a really good job at picking them. Or oh, they keep getting away with 1 HP. Oh, the trap. Rip. I'm just getting kited so hard from all the traps and stuff. But it's not bad. That could have been way worse. Didn't have everybody there. It's like, I need flash or ult just to kill one of them, but then there's three of them I need flash and ult for. Where did I get two of them?
And eh, maybe I just take the damage. Need to sell these for armor boots, but if I die again, I'll do it. I think we're fine. We'll have them next fight. You just need to do Baron. My team is, doesn't want to do it. Wait here. Ooh, this guy's alone, I think. Another flash away from me. Could be a kill. We got the dragon. We, we can't fight this. Kate's gonna kite too hard. Oh, so close. Oh, she got her. She got him. Just go to Baron. Dude, every single time I go in on somebody, they have flash. Every single time. I ulted Karma. She flashed. Then I went for Kate. She flashed. I went for Vagar, he flashed. I mean, they're already back up. They're not here. We could just do it. Hopefully Bully doesn't steal it. Oh, somebody's over the wall. I missed. Fine. Nice! Okay. I think we're good to go. Oh yeah, that we killed her. Wait, we killed Karma? Eight must have flashed. Please don't steal this. Oh my god, I got it. Seven seconds on R. We can maybe go back in. It's just so hard to get to this Kate when she's got a whole team peeling her. But now with Baron, and we could we could use Baron to wait for Elder. I don't know. Could be here. Yep. I'm taking it. Dude. That's actually... How do I get so unlucky? We just lost the game off that rip. My bad. How does everybody live with 1 HP? I, I don't think I've been more unlucky ever in my life than this game. Every single person I've ulted has lived with 1 HP and got away. But, honestly, we could have won this game like 20 minutes ago. It's just Varus and... I don't know. We just refused a group. Every single fight is always like 3v5.
But maybe they can defend, but I think it's over at this Kate. Kate just has so much front line, and that guy just did it. Yeah. I mean, if my team wanted to win, we would have won earlier. They just didn't want to do Baron, didn't want to do objectives. Didn't want to go for Kate. But yeah, it was fun. I just, it just sucks. Like, every single person I ulted literally lived with one HP and flashed away. But their whole team played against me. Their whole team focused me. Their whole team built anti-heal. They only went for me. But yeah, it is what it is. I didn't have teammates. See the damage. That sucks, dude. Volibear literally lived for my ult with 1 HP. We did 45k. Here's our rune stance. I'll see you guys later. Thanks again for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Peace.